Now we're going to look at the uh, radio stack for the DC-3. A little bit confusing to some, so we'll open it up. You see that you have your V8F navigation aid 1, 2, your communication 1 and 2, and the tuners for the ADF, left and right, and the mute and audio buttons for your ADF. Now what we're going to do is we're going to set in, say, a VHF uh, VOR frequency of 108.75. So you can see here real closely we're on 110. So if you put the cursor to the upper left and click, you can see that it goes down to 108. Say we want to make it 108.75. You come to the bottom to adjust the, the numbers past the decimal. 108.75. We set our navigation 1 here by clicking it and you see that the uh, arrow moved here. We're out of range right now so it's not picking up the signal. Now let's go to VH2. You can set that if you like but we're going to set an ADF frequency. We're going to hone in on an NDB and we're going to say that that NDB is uh, let's just give it a number of uh, 195. So you look here you see the ranges. This only goes up to 190. We've got to click it once to get in the range of the 195s and this is our crank handle just put your cursor right on the crank and we gotta go down and you can crank it down down and down and down and down and down and down and down to 195 and that's going to be our ADF2 and that is already selected on our switch we can select the audio button And if you pick up the NDB, you would hear the audio. Now your COM button, it works the same way. Let's say we're going to tune in 118.1. Or we're going to go, well, in this case we could go up because it only goes up to 136. And it's already set to 0.1. If you're going to change it to 0.2, uh, you would just or click it on the bottom side, 118.1, and our COM1 is set there. So now we're set to do our navigation.